In terms of the offensive flow last year, right? I didn't see you guys play last year. Yeah. Has it felt the same this year? Just overall, right? Receivers, running backs, quarterback. Like, what has it felt like? You've gotten sort of like a, a rhythm and a flow out there as an offense. Uh, it's it's on and off, you know. Like, we'll be going very well, and then someone will set us back. It's just we just gotta continue, just execute, just keep executing, just keep. Con- uh, what Coach Moss says. Uh, what do you call it? Oh, complimenting each other, yeah, basically, yeah. Yeah. But that's about it. Does it feel like um, there's just so many pieces moving in and out with injuries and different things? I mean, I know you've missed some time. Yeah. Some pretty big pieces have missed time. Has that influenced you guys on offense this year? Uh, well, if I get injured, I know players are going to do well. I know if Kay gets injured, I know his back is going to do well. Mm-hmm. So it's, it's a factor, but... I just know our backups, whoever it is, who's going to replace us, going to do good. Can you walk me through your touchdown today? So, you know, it was, you know, a bubble screen outside and you had a couple lead blockers and you're gone. Like, can you kind of walk me through uh, how that un- developed and, and got the first score today? Uh, it was just a regular little swing pass, stepped up, saw the ball, and read my blockers in and out, and took off. Um, Plez, what, what can you tell me about, uh, you had a play here um, on the, in this end zone early in that, like this side of the ball, this side of the field um, in that in that first half, and uh, you broke free momentarily, right, like 10, 20 yards down the field. The last guy's lunging to get a shoelace tackle. He sort of lands it, but you didn't fall, and then by that time the safety had kind of gotten the angle on you. Yeah. Um, it's got to be uh, a little bit like, ah, oh, like it was there and then it wasn't there. And then, you know, you guys didn't score on that drive. So, like, what can you tell me about a, a play like that and just what's going through your head and, like, how close you felt you were to, like, bust and lose for a score? Yeah, um, I, I seen it. Um, I just, I just, I just got to do a better job, you know, work on my balance and keeping my feet on that play. That should have been six. Um, so, uh, it hurts, you know, just to know that um, you had a chance, you had an opportunity to score and help your team out. Um, and then you, you guys fall short on that, so it hurt. It hurt a lot. Have you? What have you seen from the offense, right? So you got to kind of watch it, and you were in the you were in the scout team a little bit earlier in the year. Had you know got some reps against Murray State and a couple other games. Like, what have you seen? How has the offense evolved? And then and maybe the second part would be how has your game kind of evolved as well in that in that? Um, I, f- I feel like as an offense, we're we're, we're getting better. It, it may not. You know, look like it on like on like when we play games, but we are getting better. We're getting closer. I definitely feel like the O line is doing um, a great job, um, and I've learned. I mean, I've learned a lot. I'm learning from one of the best backs, um, if not the best back in our conference. So I mean, he's always helping me and um, you know keeping me in the game and keeping my head up when I'm you know make a mistake or miss a cut. You know, he's he's always been there for me, and you know that, that's just him. So it's great to um, have a leader like him in um in our running back room. So I got the stat sheet here. Um, a couple things that jumped off. So you guys had one red zone trip, and then you guys were over ten on third down. Anything you guys can tell me, kind of what's going on and what was factoring into that today? Uh, just, just execution. We gotta block better, and we gotta, we need to get open on routes better. You know, that's just all it is. Can you tell me, Plaz, what do you see? What do those numbers mean to you in terms of over ten, and and one one trip to the red area? You know, kind of would just, um, Dink said, you know, execution, you know, we got to, you know, throw better. Um, but we act, we also got to run the ball better. You know, we, um, I mean, when you run the ball, you won't get in those situations like that. So we um, got to run the ball better too, so. Anything you guys saw from um, the Penguins, their offense, in terms of like, right, you guys are in this game, and then they kind of maybe took another gear in terms of like converting that third down, which they hadn't done in the first half. And then even like just their quarterback kind of scrambling to get outside for you know some pickups, some big pickups, some big touchdowns. Anything you guys felt like kind of tilted the game in terms of being tied at half and then losing that second half over nothing? Uh, I guess the momentum shift is when they got that when it was ten uh, seven and they got a touchdown. I, I felt a little shift in the air. And we're like, oh, we're a little backed up. We got to score, you know. Mm-hmm. We got we got to score. Uh, that's mostly it. Yeah, Justin, what can you tell me about an 0-9 start, man? It's got to be, like, the worst thing to hear, right, starting 0-9. What can you tell me about the emotion behind, like, going through it and then just wanting to bounce back? You guys still got two more weeks to go. Yeah, it sucks. It's just no one wants to be 0-9, you know, but it's about how you 
come to work every day. You're still going to do the same thing. So have a good attitude while you do it. And we're just going to play the last two games like we're 9-0. So. Yeah. Any, any, I know people say, you know, the, the cliche, like, have a good attitude. But, like, what does that exactly kind of mean? Like, how, how is that relatively, like, tangible? You know, how can you tangibly show that? Uh, just mastering your craft. Going yeah. to work every day. Really uh, just going to work. Um, putting your nose to the um, putting your nose to the plow and just keep on going, keep on moving. You know you can't can't change the past, you know, but you can um, change the future. So keep on doing that. Thanks, yeah. Thank you. Thank you.